know there's some question with Eric that he, that he practiced yesterday with you guys? Uh, Eric was, yesterday was like a walkthrough, so he was out there. Um, but the, the guys that weren't doing a whole lot in terms of, of uh, intense stuff. Do you anticipate him practicing this week? Uh, I think he will. Uh, we'll see. Probably get, uh, get Monday was the walkthrough. Yesterday, yesterday he was out there, but he didn't. He didn't do everything. But I do think he'll be be back at some point in the week. I just allowed him to sort of explode the last couple of weeks. Seventeen catches, I think, in the last three games. What has he done so well? He's just. I mean, he's such a hard worker. He's the kind of guy that if you uh, if you observe him, really, his whole career here, you would say that guy's going to be really good because his habits are so good in terms of the way that he runs routes, the speed at which he practices, um, the extra work that he puts in, his desire to be really good. So it's, it's really just, you know, with guys like that, it's just kind of a matter of time because their, their habits are, are such that you just know that they're gonna, they're gonna break through when the opportunity arises. And uh, I think everyone was excited to see him, you know, have those balls come his way, which doesn't always happen at, at, at the tight end position, especially not in that volume. Uh, so it was cool to see both, you know, the balls come that way and to be ready for it and to make some of the plays he did. Uh, it was an outstanding game for him. It was, it was very cool to see. He deserves to have that kind of success. Daniel? I know you touched on Eric's work ethic, but I'm curious, throughout this season, where do you think he's grown from a technical standpoint? Uh, that's a tough question. He, it kind of, not, not as like a cop-out answer, but the way that he approaches things, he, because of, of his intensity, he gets better at everything uh, incrementally. When you see um, the way that he's catching the ball, that obviously jumps out because he, he is catching it really well. Uh, he's sustaining blocks better than he has, ever has before. Uh, he's a guy who produces such great force on contact because uh, he bends so well, he gets great leverage. And he strikes people, I mean, like a hammer, and then Sometimes he falls off the contact or doesn't necessarily finish through the whistle on the same guy. When you watch him closely, you'll notice this here, he's, he's done a lot better job in terms of, okay, making great initial contact, knocking the guy back, and then finishing on the man as the, as the play finishes. So that's been cool to see. Uh, but really, it's hard to pinpoint any one area just because uh, the growth has been, been um, pretty well-rounded.